Want to change our phone? Yes, please. I saw Phil leave a while ago. Where did he go? Do you see Pete and Trent? Yes. Phil overheard them talking about some men they know who are getting jobs from Nobura. Do you think there's any connection between Nobura's jobs, the stranger from Tokyo, and 722? That's what Phil has gone to find out at the house of Shan Su. There can be no doubt, Fox, that our plan will ensure final victory to Japan. Yeah, Nobura. But suppose X-9 finds out what we're really trying to do. X-9 and our Fong lost their last chance to find out about us this afternoon, when you made sure no one followed you. Secret Agent X-9. Welcome to the house of Shen So, Secret Agent X-9. While you die here, Arfang will be killed in what looks like a gambler's brawl at the House of Shadows. You know what to do, Pete? Yeah, slip me the dough. Dollary don't. You're for me, Solo. Dollary does. Bet's down. Hands off. Looks like trouble marker at our farm's table. Nothing to worry about yet. Two more, he don't. Bet. Four. Wait a minute. The odd wins. Are you trying to pull something crooked? There are no crooked games in the House of Shadows. You're a liar. The big money is on the odd. I saw what you did, and I want my winnings. Very sorry. There are no winnings for you. You're not going to get off that easy with me. Not on a raw deal like this. My father just happened to hit the killer, but he'd still have shot our Fong if Solo hadn't dropped him. Trent there, and you, Pete, ought to know better than pick on anybody working for Lucky Camber. That's why I wasn't on my toes. You'll have to watch sharper after this, Marker. Spies are taking advantage of Shadow Island's neutrality. <laughs> That's why Trent is dead now. You, Pete. Honest, Lucky, I didn't know Trent was gunning for our Fong. I was just paid to beat him up, that's all. I don't want any real trouble. Knowing you, Pete, that sounds about right to me. Okay, this time, Pete. I'll beat it. Okay, I'll take your word on Pete. But what about this dead man here? He tried to lead me to a death trap. Uh, that's my cue. <laughs> Listen, folks. What I'm going to say goes for everyone. I'm the boss around here, and that's the way it has to be. Anybody, anybody, get this, that interferes with anyone working for me, gets just exactly what Trent got. Include yourself in, Corrigan. You too, Nabora. You are visible proof, Mr. Corrigan that I am not always so efficient as I could desire. But persistent. So am I. Persistency is wisdom. Only when there is a chance for success. I'd leave for the United States if I were you. It's an old American custom not to travel backwards, Nabura. 
My people have had to make a virtue of retreat. As for you, Afang, Mr. Camber has just declared open season on secret service men. And secret service women, too, I believe. All right, give me a hand. I must ask a favor of you, Miss Moore. Certainly, Nabur. What is it? Kakahari is late. I can wait for him no longer. When he comes, tell him to go at once to Trent's room in the house of Lin San. The house of Lin San? I'll tell him. Thank you, Miss Moore. And there will be no broadcast tonight from the submarine. The more pressure X-9 puts on the world, the more help she's going to demand from me. And what chance have I got? Any time Japan wants to take over Shadow Island, that's that. But Japan can't move if you stop Nabura. <laughs> All you're telling me is try to stop Japan. I'll also tell you how to do it. Find out the meaning of the number 722. How did you know about that number? There isn't much going on around here that I don't know, is there? If I've got the answer to 722, I can always threaten to tell X-9. And then the Buro won't dare get tough. Japan, either. Go inside, Bob. Watch everybody Miss Moore talks to. If she uses the telephone, I want to know it. X-9 our phone left some time ago. I know. They are searching for Trent's room. But I am the only one who knows where he stayed. Ah, uh, so? And why, please, is Bob watching Miss Moore? I told her the address to test her loyalty. Nobody can betray us but her. But she has been to Japan. She broadcasts our propaganda. Never trust a quisling. Take two men with you and go to Trent's room in the house of Lin San. Here's what you want, Takahari. Listen to this. Don't try to get in touch with me for a while. Sorry I missed you. There's a big deal on at the house of Shan So, and I'm cut in. You'll probably be in it sooner or later. But don't say anything till I see you. How's that? It's signed Bill Browder. Hey, he writes pretty, don't he? Just what I want. And now quickly, straighten the room. Fix the room? What for? We may have visitors soon. Secret Agent X-9 and our phone. What a shame we'll have to disappoint Takahari. What about Bill Browder? Do you know him? A disreputable character. We'll wait for him in your room. Does he stay at the Dupre Hotel? Just down the hall from you. Hello, Lorelei. This is Captain Groot. Ah, Nahura. Yes. I will come to see you as soon as possible. I must wait here until Takahari reports. Say good. Is something the matter? Papura is delayed, that is all. I am sorry. I wanted the decision. This man, the one named Browder, is unsuitable. It seems to me Browder resembles the man I saw in your motion picture. Superficially, he does. But I do not think it's wise to send him to the United States to double Raymond. You studied with Raymond. You should know. I must be very sure of my choice. So much depends on it. It's the only way to take advantage of the accidental discovery that Raymond's unsuccessful formula for a new explosive makes a perfect substitute for aviation gasoline. Fortunately for us, Raymond does not realize that his experiment 722 is so valuable. Yeah, the right double should be able to take the record from his files. While the wrong one might give the whole plan away. I'll have Browder sent back to shore. Oh, wait. Browder has seen my motion picture of Raymond. But doesn't know his name. And yet, if he talks, it might give the United Nations something to work on. You are right. You will put Valor into an empty cabin under guard until Nabura decides what to do with him. Yeah. That is wise. We should take no risk with a man who can be so valuable to X-9. Hello, Mama Pierre. Is Mr. Corrigan in? Perhaps he is. Oh, perhaps he went out the back door. Do you mind if I find out? Who am I to stop guests of having visitors? You are so gracious, Mama. What 
are you two doing? We're waiting for a man named Browder to come back to his room up the hall. Bill Browder? Mm -hmm. I took it for granted you'd follow up on Trent. I know where he lives. How did you find out? We located him, but only after we'd followed Takahari. Takahari? Wynabora gave me Trent's address to tell Takahari. But I haven't seen him. It was the first chance I had to let you know. There's your answer, Alfon. Huh? Answer to what? Nabora figured you'd give us Trent's address. Yeah, she was testing you again. Whew. That's too close for comfort. You may not be in the clear yet. You better go. Use the rear entrance. Watch out for Nabora's pets. Watch carefully the way the man uses his hands, his smile, the way he walks. It would not be necessary for you to look exactly like him. What you must be able to do is to make others who know him think that you are the man long enough to accomplish what we want. That is of utmost importance. How are things progressing? Very satisfactorily. Any one of these men will answer our purpose. Duke, Miley, Gar, or so. Where is Browder? Hakahima said Browder won't do. I thought he might wish to talk to him. Excellent. Proceed with your instructions. Bach telephoned that Miss Moore did not betray us. How did Takahari make out? Covered the only trail X-9 could possibly find leading to us. Where is Browder? D-suite. Yogel is amusing him. So, I will visit them. Explain, please. Browder said he talked to you himself. He tricked me. And got away. How long, please? I... I don't know. Then I had better arrange matters for Browder as fast as possible. the idea? What do you guys want? Information, brother. I haven't got any. You know me, don't you? Sure, you're X-9. So what? You wrote a note to Trent. Him and me are old pals. Trent's dead. Yeah. Uh -huh. He'd be alive now if Nabora's gold hadn't looked so easy to him. What were you doing for her in the house of Shanso? Look, guys, I'm in deep enough as it is. Any talking I do will get me the same thing Trent got. You know something that we've got to know, brother. Well, if I were back in the States, maybe I'd answer your questions, but as long as I'm on Shadow Island, I'm deaf, dumb, and blind. Watch it. Give us the information we want. Anything you want to know. Okay, where's your car? It's on the next street, but I can't get to it now. That's why you're safe with us, Browder. We'll take the risks to keep you alive. Look, I'll take Browder's car and lead them on a wild goose chase. That ought to give you time to question him and put him where Nabura's men can't find him. Plenty of time. Where's your car? Down the street. <laughs> 